It just came out that CDC testing guidance was published against scientists' objections, with officials telling the Times this week that the Department of Health and Human Services did the rewriting of what should merit a test, and then dropped it in the CDC's public website, flouting the agency's strict scientific review process. Now, we knew as soon as that change was done that this is definitely why it was done. It was the natural culmination of we need to slow down the testing, you do a test, you get a case. We knew that. And it is indeed true. So that happened despite the fact that you know, you've know you got Fauci and he says that Burks is good. Or this week when it came out that the White House reportedly scrapped a plan to mail face masks to every household in the US because they thought it would create a concern or a panic. Maybe it would have, it would have also hypothetically produced a little bit more compliance with the masks to show support at the very beginning from the White House telling right wingers that this is a good thing that you should do. And it also would have let them have masks. So. From the, and, and there's all the stuff with Jared early on, like he, I'm glad that he's there. I'm glad that he has this mission to make sure that science is on sort of an equal footing. But as I look back over the pandemic, it doesn't seem like that has often been the case. Also, I mean, as you'll see on the Young Turks later today, Jared Kushner, this, I mean, that last story that you spoke about is a bombshell. Because Jared Kushner very recently has said the reason that New York didn't get Masks and PPE is it because they weren't asking us enough. Why mm-hmm. why didn't he break down our door and ask us? No, 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 no. It was all ready to go out. And it was the White House who stopped it. Why? Because they didn't want to create a panic. But yeah. did they but that would there be a I mean, what's panicking about getting masks in the mail? All the other crap I get in the mail. They don't want to panic people. Trump is sending out and the Republicans are sending out flyers saying that the Democrats are coming for your family. The in South Carolina in Georgia, they're saying, look at this Jew with the big nose. And and they're saying, listen, the every time the the Democrats get someone, they're gonna kill a bunch of babies. That stuff goes out in the mail. Getting mm-hmm. masks in the mail. Oh my God, I didn't want to start a panic. You know what's gonna create a panic? What should create a panic? 200,000 people dead and he hasn't done anything except and if and this is the through line with a lot of people from Joe Rogan all the way down to Donald Trump and Charlie Kirk and and Tucker Carlson. If they spent an eighth of the effort that they currently spend on trying to find excuses and cover ups for their stupidity. Mm-hmm. If they spent an eighth of that they effort succeeded. on actually fixing problems or doing a little research, they'd solve it. There would be nothing else to talk about. You would have a a wild success story on your hands, but they don't. They would rather sit there and try to find a way to message their their way out of this. And it would have been so simple. They they like I I know that we talk about this a lot, but if they had just 50% taken it seriously compared to some randomly chosen Western European country, we would have 80,000 dead or whatever. And they, he'd be cruising to victory. Like it would, what a stupid authoritarian movement America is going to inevitably fall to. And meanwhile, um, meanwhile, like, the, and we'll talk about this in a garbage people segment, but like four people died in Benghazi, and that was a tragedy. This is what, a hundred thousand times worse? Yeah. You know, like 50,000 times worse? Yeah, and every day it's you know three hundred times worse. Um, yeah, and uh, and also I'm sure that they'll, you'll talk about it on the main show. But um, the the people who met with Jared Kushner early on that said it was fairly clear that he didn't care about New York because it was a blue state, even though he like his businesses are there. But it's been so obvious. I mean, Donald Trump couldn't be more obvious that he literally wants to deduct the blue state numbers. Um, from the numbers, and by the way, somebody did an analysis. If you took those out, just the red states still top ten most deaths or highest death rate. Anyway, um, yeah, and and Jared Kushner initially stopping some of the purchases early on, like whole book could just be written about Jared Kushner and how he helped to make the pandemic as horrible as it could possibly be. Colorado, like trying to fix the problem with the ventilators and actually reducing the number of ventilators and giving the, the some profit to a private company over it. Because they meddle, because they can't help themselves. They're, they mess up. They are the team that couldn't shoot straight. Yeah.
For more political news breakdowns, interviews, stories of activism, and me trying my hardest to care about the occasional big celebrity news story, subscribe to our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash the damage report. And you can ring the bell wherever it is so you don't miss anything.